Barbara, I'm currently on job search visa and doing study related job as well. And we get two years visa because of new changes. But can I get essential visa as well after that two years? So if you were an AJB student by now, you would have had complete clarity as to what exactly you need to do. But obviously, you're not an AJB student, but you have come to this forum and asked me a question. So I'm quite happy to answer that. So if you're in your post in your postery work visa period uh, to get an essential skill, so you're saying uh, you're in a related uh, job uh, as well, and and you may get a two years for the work visa, which is great. But can I get essential skills work visa after that two years? It depends whether you're matching the criteria for that essential skills work visa. What is the criteria for the essential skills work visa? And I have it always uh, uh, ready uh, uh, on my uh, pinned up board here uh, so that I can refer those figures to you guys straight away. For an essential skills work visa, you need to get a salary of $42,952 at the minimum. Plus, you need to have an employer who is going to support you with that uh, uh, job application, with the application, uh, and you know provide the required documents. Plus, uh, uh, the employer should also provide proof that they try to recruit a local New Zealand citizen or a New Zealand resident, and because they were not able to, is why uh, you know they are offering that job to you. So, it requires certain amount of documentation, and it is not very easy. Uh, to put that kind of uh, thing together.